Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. Today's video is all about chickens. Just joking, it's about horses. It's always about horses. Today, we're gonna reveal our new secret horse. But before that, I wanted to show you guys that even chickens like love. She loves love. Doesn't she love love? Mm -hmm. She's like, rub me. I think this is our Easter egger. She's gonna be jumping hoops. Sophie's thinking that she's gonna be able to teach this little tiny chicken to jump hoops. She might look a little off that she's just laying here so quiet and still, but it's because I'm a chicken magician. I can make them quiet and calm. Just joking, it's because she has a harness on. <laughs> Sophie put a harness on her and she's freaking out. She's like, take it off or I'm not moving. Kinda like when you put a harness on a cat What's her name again? Zoe. This is Zoe. This is Zoe. And yeah, we have chickens in the house because that's how we roll. So we have this old harrow. See it? I wanted to take it with me today because I want to use it in the yard. And there's a robin's egg in it. It is actually so super chilly out today. It's supposed to be 14 degrees again, but there's a big wind, so it's really cold. I think I need to go up and get my coat. Sam is home today and he is out getting hay. He already got one load of hay and he's getting another one. It's a long weekend, so we wanna be extra prepared. I am super proud of this girl who obviously has been pushing the ropes, but she hasn't broken free to be with her boy, to be with a boy. Sophie's spending some time with Finny. We are, surprise, surprise, waiting for Gabby. It's true, we are waiting for Gabby. She's just getting ready. Whoa, what, it's okay. What scared him? Oh, he stepped on the hula hoop. Don't, don't be mad at him when he gets scared. Just tell him he's okay. Well, Gabby's here. What are you doing today? Riding. Gabby's riding today. I'm gonna go out and work on our arena. I'm gonna show you what I wanna do. We have to introduce them to the new horse today. We forgot to introduce them yesterday. Today, yesterday you said, I want to introduce them to the new horse, and then we forgot. And so now they're all wondering, who the heck is the new horse? So remind me when we get back to the house and we'll do it there, okay? Okay. Sophie is trying to desensitize Finny to the hula hoop, just the sounds of it moving. He's not too bad about it. He's not too bad about it when it touches him, when he goes near it, when he steps over it. It's just the sound of it that he's worried about. Yeah, so when he's, yeah, so she's doing that. If you guys are curious, then you should know that we are working on more poles. Look at the room is getting empty. Gabby's working on the red. Let's do the color reveal for the red. Whoa, it is gorgeous. Red is one of my favorite colors. I love that red. I asked them to get us more paint brushes because we ran out. Hope you don't get those on your good, your good pants. Yeah, painting is rough. That is gorgeous. <laughs> all right, Finny is gonna have to go in his own pen again soon because all they do is spend time frustrating each other. You didn't give the ponies water. Did you, did you give the ponies water? No. They need water. So things are drying up here in Canada. It's such a weird thing. In Ontario, it can be three degrees in the morning and then 20 degrees in the afternoon. It's insane. Uh, we did a little bit of riding in our arena uh, way back before things were really dry. They're still not completely dry, but getting better. Anyway, today we're gonna take some time and try and fix this arena. Um, there's just a few spots. Like, basically when you ride in an outdoor arena, you get like these little, divots or whatever they're called little areas where it gets low from the hooves from the horse's hooves there's a good one see so i have fertilizer and soil in here and i'm going to fill these in I pack them down and then i'm going to re uh seed them definitely it's going to take me a while to figure out how to get all this stuff done sam has that um harrow thing that I showed you guys that had the bird's nest on it. I wanted him to harrow the field. If you turn the harrow upside down, instead of like digging into the ground and wrecking the grass, it will uh, make small, it'll move, move dirt 
and grass from small from high areas and push them into like the small areas which is what I needed um, but I'm also gonna do this so we'll see what happens today Sam is gone to get his tractor part his big tractor the first tractor that he had was broken and um, needed a part and he, the part that the place that fixes the his part just opened last week so he took it in and now he's gonna get to get his tractor working again okay oh I'm beat trying to fill in all the things. It's rewarding work, but long and tedious work. So only a half, like only a small quarter of our arena is, is kind of soft because we run on it too early. The rest of it's not too bad. The girls are gonna have one last ride before the weekend because it's supposed to re it's supposed to rain a Friday, Sunday, Monday. So we're gonna have a fun day on Saturday. We're going on our first trail ride. I told you guys, Kaylee and Gabby and me, just us. I'm going to take Betsy the bike instead of a horse so that the girls can actually have fun. Have Betsy. Yeah, I want the girls to have fun. They're going to have cameras on them. They're going to be able to go far and go ahead of me. And get, they both want to gallop at some point. Like, we're going to. I'm going to be sitting in the car. Yeah, Gabby's going to, Sophie's going to stay with Sam, and we're just going to have fun. I'm having a food break, a freezy break. Ruby's like, have a Ruby break. Have a Ruby um, break. Um, Mm -hmm. Last time we did it, Kaylee's dad. After? Yeah. Oh, Last time, Kaylee's dad brought a grill, and but they're in the process of moving to their first farm, so. I don't know if they're gonna be able to do that, but it was super fun last time. We're gonna have fun. It's gonna be our first mature trail ride because I'm not gonna scream and get worked out. Get McDonald's for the trail, like while we are, we're on the trail. We should take McDonald's while we're on the trail. Yeah. Last night I dreamed to take my fanny pack with me, so I don't know what that means. I don't know why God wants me to know that, but I dreamed to take your fanny pack with you. All right, you guys, we are out here. We got it going on. Riding storm because Fim's hurt. She's worried because she needs to practice her canter. She doesn't want you guys to think she doesn't love her boy because she does. Um, I filled in a lot of rivets. We're not done, but we're gonna try and stay in the area that's like harder and more firm. This side of the arena. Gino's like, let's do it. Love seeing them ride outside. I wish the ground was like perfect and everything was all. Because I'm a worry war. I worry about everything. He's coming to get the whip. Watch you stay, Ruby. Here we go. So he's got her whip. She's a little nervous about Stormy Boy. Once I get back to you, I'm getting All right. Yeah. Dad'll put the gate up. Got Ruby here. Got a very needy group of riders. Can you do this? Can you do that? Not injuring himself. Yeah, oh, I agree. So, these jumps we bought, Sam bought last year. I'm not in love with them because they don't stand up very well, but I do kind of like them. I mean, they're jumps. So, I'm going to get Sam to fix them up for us so that they're better. You better turn up. You better be there when I shake. Watch me rocking if I can't stop. If I should fall, just go ahead.
baby. You don't have to go super fast. Just ride and get some exercise is all I care. Watch that thing. Trail. Good. Hold your legs. You have good legs, Soap. Her legs are moving around. She usually has really good legs. She hasn't done it in a while, so she grows thin. Yeah. And thin, you don't even control where your legs go. On storm, you do. But on storm, it's easier for me to ride thin. All right, let him have a walk. Good job. Wanna get to your clothes, gotta get it right now I wanna push all the limits with you right now So watch your feelings, the city screaming when I'm coming home tonight We're living quick in the world, gotta get it right now People talk and tell what you wanna hear now But they all disappear, they will let you down so Better stick together, let's come whatever We're not coming home tonight We're living quick in the world, gotta get it right now
if any of you guys have been missing Molly today, I'm gonna to show her to you now. Molly spent a long time in her cage this afternoon while we, the girls were riding and she did such a good job. She's doing so well. Look at how much bigger she looks. Like she looks, she she's looks older. Energetic. One of her ears is up. She's more energetic. She's super energetic. She just runs out the door every time I open it. She's such a good little puppy. Um, we're at the point in the vlog that we are going to introduce you to our new horse. We did actually get a new horse. I'm excited. I just have to say that I love and appreciate so many of you guys that have fun with me, like in the comments. Some of the comments were amazing. So much fun. I love you guys like playing around with us. And if you guys play Roblox with me, you are so nice. Yeah, Sophie's been really enjoying the people that she's been playing Roblox with, right? Um, anyways, so this is our new horse. Some of you guys guessed that it was the big, huge, giant, inflatable unicorn that we got the other day. We plan to put it in the Molly field rides with the, it. We plan to put it in the field with the horses. Some of my friends have recently got their horse is a pool and are putting it in their horse field and I'm kind of excited about that and I told Fiona and Fiona <coughs> said well don't get like make sure you get a specific kind so they don't get hurt blah 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 and we said okay that's what we're gonna do and then Sam uh, came up to me and he had that thing in his cart and I was like you know what let's just do it it will be fun and it'll be good for my grandkids good for us and good for the horses so then I told Fiona that we got that and she said yeah that's terrifying and i said yeah so obviously before we show it to the horses we're gonna have to do like a lot of desensitizing <laughs> okay. um but um, it'll be fun molly has a spot here she has a black spot here that we never knew about yep before. she has a tiny black spot we got her and then she has a black spot on her stomach black spot on she said dalmatian Goodness, I got a black and white Dalmatian. Um, also, Dalmatian. vets are getting more in, our vets are starting to work more, and she's getting her shots next week. Finally, she'll get all her flea and tick and her weight, and we'll get all of her puppy check. Are you excited? Yes. Yeah, me too.